Welcome to day three of our program. Today, we will delve into the connection between sugar and cravings. We will explore how excess sugar intake can lead to a cycle of cravings and overeating. And most importantly, we will provide you with effective strategies to manage cravings and substitute unhealthy sugary snacks with healthier options. Now, let's understand the connection between sugar and craving. The first point, sugar and brain. When we consume sugar, it activates the brain reward center and releasing uh, dopamine and creating a pressurable sensation. Second point, cravings and sugar uh, cycle. Excess sugar consumption can disrupt the balance of our hunger regulating hormones, leading to increased cravings for more sugary food. Third point, blood sugar fluctuations. Consuming sugary snacks can cause a rapid rise and subsequent crash in blood sugar level, triggering further cravings for quick energy. Now, let's discuss the effects of excess sugar intake. The rapid rise and fall of blood sugar level can leave us feeling tired, sluggish and craving for more sugar for a quick energy boost. So this is what we call energy crashes. Effect number two is what we call weight gain. Regularly consuming uh, excess sugar can lead to weight gain due to increased calorie intake and the potential for overeating. Uh, and the uh, effect number three is nutritional deficiency. High sugar foods often, lacks, often uh, lack essential nutrients, leading to an imbalanced diet and potential deficiency. So now, let's talk about the strategies to manage cravings and substitute unhealthy snacks. So the first strategy would be eat balanced meals. You can opt for meals that include combination of protein, healthy fat, and fiber-rich carbohydrates to help stabilize blood sugar level and keep cravings at bay. Choose whole food. Opt for whole and processed foods that are naturally sweet, such as fruits, to satisfy your sweet tooth while providing essential nutrients and fiber. Strategies number three, stay hydrated. Sometimes we mistaken, we mistake uh, thirst for hunger and cravings. Stay hydrated by drinking water throughout the day to reduce the likelihood of cravings. Strategy four, mindful eating. Pay attention to your body's hunger and fullness cues. Engage in mindful eating practice to savor your food. Slow down eating and recognize satiety. Strategy 5. Plan ahead. Have healthier snacks options readily available, such as cut up fruits, nuts, and yogurts, to prevent reaching for sugary snacks out of convenience. You can also find healthier alternatives, identify healthier alternatives to your favorite sugary snacks such as homemade energy balls, dark chocolates, or unsweetened yogurt with fresh fruit. Another good strategy would be to distract yourself. When, when cravings strike, engage in activities that divert your attention such as going for a walk, reading a book, or calling a friend. Next, you can also manage stress. Stress can contribute to cravings. Incorporate stretch, uh, stress management techniques like deep breathing, meditation, or engaging in hobbies to reduce stress level. Get sufficient sleep. Lack of sleep can disrupt hunger regulating hormones, leading to increased cravings. Aim for quality sleep to support overall well being. Congratulations on completing day 4 and gaining insights into the connection between sugar and cravings. By understanding how excess sugar intake can lead to a cycle of cravings and overeating, you are now equipped with strategies to manage cravings and make healthier choices. Remember to choose whole foods, stay hydrated and practice mindful eating. Tomorrow, we will focus on decoding food labels to identify hidden sugars. Keep up the great work and I will see you on day four.